Ooh, that might be bad. Eh, only two weeks. Plus, I don't think national team duty is going to happen for a while. Let's see. Uh, World Cup qualifiers next. And what do they want me to do for qualifiers? Just be competitive. Okay. I could win permission easily out of the Vision D, which I did already. But qualifying, just be competitive. Okay. Okay. Um, I can for sure beat Gibraltar twice. These two games are, I think we should win easy. If we could pick up a draw against either Portugal, like one or two draws against Portugal or the Czech Republic, and beat Slovakia and Norway, Norway I'm kind of worried about, because I think if I remember correctly, Erling Holland plays for them? Key player, Erling Holland. And he can score. <laughs> he can score. And they have a good defender. I mean, what else do they need? <laughs> yeah, so I'm not I'm not looking forward to that one. And Czech Republic's actually probably better. So I'm not looking forward to that. But if we can if we can grab a shock win or draw against one of Portugal or Czech Republic. And we make sure that we somehow beat Slovakia twice. We could... It, it, it is possible to actually qualify out of this group. It's just going to be real tough. And I mean real tough. Like, let me, let me just show you real quick. This is second place team stuff, but... Here's our group right here for qualifying. I'll take it fifth or fourth, honestly, out of this group. Sixth, I just can't take. I, no, nah. I can't take sixth in this group because we should be better than Gibraltar in every aspect. If we get third, I'll take it. If we get second, we give ourselves a chance to somehow make the World Cup. The only teams that I'm worried about for second place 
are a couple big nations that may um, underperform somehow. But mainly I'm thinking Hungary, one of either Bulgaria or Switzerland. I think I'd actually be more scared of Switzerland or Bosnia, not Bulgaria. Um, Turkey's the main one I would be worried about playing out of group three in second place teams. Poland is probably going to be the second place team in group four here, and that's not going to be great. In group six here, either Austria or Ireland, which neither of those are really that challenging. Italy should win that group easily. And then here's the next big group that I'm worried about with second place, if I even make second place. <laughs> Because I could play one of either Denmark, Finland, Russia, or Scotland, probably, in that second place. I don't think Lithuania has what it takes to be second. But all those teams will be kind of challenging each other in that group. Group 8, I'm worried about uh, France mishap or Sweden second place, really. Romania in Group 9 is the main team I'm worried about. And then probably one of either Croatia, Wales, or Ukraine in Group 10. But, like I said, I'm really only expecting... We'll see. Is it sad that <laughs> my two... My captain and vice captain are probably going to be players that are not even going to play for me at all this season. Like, come on. But, yeah, I don't really care that much about doing that. Because, in my experience, hasn't had a big enough impact for me to actually care, so... Looking for a mid, uh, probably a mid-table finish in this division, even though I'd prefer promotion immediately to the Premier League. That would be the best. If I get promoted, that would be the best for me and the team. But I'm not sure how well we're going to do. Let's see, our projected place is 10th in the league. Because we lost Olsen and Horsen, or Torsen, Torsen. And nothing I could do about that, really. Oh, and we also lost our goalkeeper. So, yeah. Um, not sure how well this is going to go. And 10th is dead last. I mean, we've upset media predictions before, so... Who's to say that we can't do it this time? I'm just gonna have to rely on youth. Probably going to be going for about mm, two and a half, maybe two hours, two and a half. I don't know. We'll see. We'll see what I feel like.
fight bravely against relegation, be competitive in the Copa Cup. Personally, I would like to actually play in the Cup this year. <laughs> and I would like to actually, I don't know, win the Cup this year, because the first year we took part of it, and the only year we actually took part in the Cup, we almost won it. But I'm not expecting to really be drawn into this. Actually, I want to take a look. Three, two, one, one. Okay. Interesting. Part in the next round, because I need the money. And I would love to qualify for Europe by winning the final. But I think we should start participating in the first round. Other than, for some weird reason, both team like all teams advance out of this, even though that's not how that should be. I mean, I don't know what I did wrong, but apparently I did something wrong. Oh well. Hanson He may end up being my goalkeeper, so I'll scout him. If he's the left back, I'll pick him up. Same thing here. Eski Olsen. Eski Olsen. Sure, I'll sign him. I'll sign him. He's going to be a ball-winning midfielder for me, yeah. Probably will actually play because he looks pretty good.
Hmm. SQL information. Hmm. <laughs> it's fluent in Pearlese, fluent in Danish, and good in Icelandic. That's what I need to know. His favored personnel, or I can just bring in a teammate of his from this team. Because, I mean, I'm gonna be honest, all these people I can pick up on a free. So. I wish I could pick up this guy, because I know he's a good player. I've given him... I've given him five caps for the senior national team. And he scored three. So, I mean, I know he's a good striker. But I think where my team is the weakest chart is right back, really. And I guess goalkeeper, according to this. I mean, that's what I'm lining up with right now, but I kind of need to clear out my squad a little bit. I seriously do probably need to clean out my squad a bit because I, it, I don't think it's physically okay for me to have, hold up, how many? Forty-seven people <laughs> in my first team squad. That's why I wish um, I had a second team or youth team or whatever just to throw people into. So we'll see. thought about uh, jumping ship to another club that offered me an interview. <laughs> uh, hold up, can I find it? Um, I can not. Uh, where, where is it? Where is it? I know. I, I know. I have it. Here. 